I don't really think they want this bunch of punches, pilots, riots on them, fire starter. Facts about the truth. One of the misfortunate things about this generation is the inability to listen and to accept the truth. Like everything is centered around this pseudo positivity. Then on the flip side, everyone views the truth as toxic or negativity. The main critique that I hear about the truth is that is harsh. Your delivery wasn't Christ-like. <laughs> now don't get me wrong. The word of God does tell us that our speech should be gracious and seasoned with salt. But the whole delivery excuse is really a cop out. I mean, in all actuality, the truth isn't really supposed to feel good. Let's look at the source of all truth, the word of God. Let's look at Hebrews 4:12. For the word of God is living and active, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing to the division of soul and spirit, of joints and of marrow, and discerning the thoughts and intentions of the heart. The truth isn't supposed to be watered down or sugar-coated. It's supposed to cut deep and, and purge any falsehoods. It separates the spiritual from the carnal, the holy from the worldly. The, tr the truth is like surgery for the soul. Yes, the initial incision may hurt. Yes, the procedure may be painful and uncomfortable. But the freedom and relief that and comfort you experience after the surgery is definitely worth the experience. Stop demonizing the truth. It may be the cure to all your mental health issues. Grace and peace, saints.